In this lesson, we'll be doing one of our age problems. This one is pretty um, self-explanatory as far as being able to write a sentence based on each, or an equation based on each sentence. But we'll read it first. Henry is nine more than three times as old as Sophia. In 20 years, the sum of their ages will be 105. How old is Henry now? So let's call Henry's age, um, should we just call Henry H? So, and Sophia, um, I don't, again, I don't like using S's. Can we call Sophia, let's say, A? I'm just going to call her A for it ends in Sophia. So here's Sophia. And that's a different spelling. It's like my daughter's name. I'm going with my kids' middle names here. Um, or grandpa's names. So now I have Henry and Sophia. Henry is, so let's start writing that sentence. Henry is nine more than nine more than three times as old as Sophia. So three times Sophia. That's not bad, right? Henry is nine more than three times as old as Sophia. There's my equation. In 20 years, the sum of their ages will be 105. So if I add Henry and Sophia's age together, in 20 years, that'll be 105. Here's the trick. Many students will do this. Henry plus Sophia plus 20 years equals 105. Here's what's wrong with that. In the next 20 years, I want you to think of your age right now. How old will you be in 20 years? So let's say you are 17, okay? You're 17. I'm 35. In 20 years, will the sum of our ages be 17 plus 35 plus 20? Well, in 20 years, I'm going to be 55, aren't I? And you're going to be 37. So what this equation is missing is it's only adding a 20 to one of our ages, not to both. And that's what we need to do. We need to add 20 years to Henry and Sophia's age. So when I write my equation, you could come over here actually and say, okay, Henry now, Sophia now, well, in 20 years, Henry's going to be H plus 20. So that's Henry in 20 years. And Sophia is going to be A plus 20. So in 20 years, she has to add 20 to her name, or her age also. So I would say my equation would be Henry plus 20 years plus Sophia plus 20 years would equal 105. And that's where most people miss this problem. And believe me, Excel Math will give you the answer if you only put 120 in there. So now what I would do from here is I would use substitution. I have 9 plus 3a plus 20 plus a plus 20 equals 105. I'm going to combine like terms. i got a lot going on here. 3a plus a is 4a. 20 plus 20 is 40 plus 9. So I have 4a plus 49 equals 105. So now I'm going to minus 49 from both sides. Get here. I have 4a equals 56. Divide by 4. And that means Sophia's age right now is 14. It doesn't ask for Sophia, though. It asks how old Henry is. So Henry, remember, is 9 more than 3 times as old as Sophia. So 9 plus 3 times 14. Henry would be 9 plus 42. Henry is 51 years old. So we would say Henry is currently 51 years old. And that's my answer.